it is that time again where I rate your meal deals. I tweeted out, it's that time again. Reply to this tweet with a picture of your go-to meal deal and I will be rating them for a video. Now, this isn't just any meal deal rating video because I have a special announcement for the next two days, the next 48 hours only. So until Sunday the 17th at 5 p.m. UK time, I am doing a merch drop. It's my first proper merch drop in years. Uh, we got this hoodie. It's a, it's a meal deal club card. It looks sick. We've also got uh, this t-shirt here. And my two favorite items of all are this t-shirt here. Hang on one sec. This. Probably doesn't look very good because I might scrunched it up. But yeah, it's like, it's like a shop. That is sick. I love it. It reminds me of one of my favorite book covers ever, Days at the Morasaki Bookshop. So I'm a big fan of that. Also, the hat. Oh, look at that. Oh, my days. So yeah, these will be available at meanless.shop. The link is in the description for 48 hours only. Don't miss out. Anyway, let's get on to rating your meal deals. What is this? <laughs> You are joking. You're joking. This isn't your actual meal deal. Walker's ready salted ham, <laughs> no mayonnaise, and an Evian. My God, you must be the most boring person to ever live. It's not disgusting, so I'm not going to give it... I, I mean, I, I feel sort of free is a fair rating because it's not disgusting. It's just, like, very bland. What on earth is this? A power... Sh a chocolate peanut butter power... That's heavy for lunchtime, that. Like, have you ever got a milkshake with a, a lunchtime meal deal? It's not a fun experience. It just weighs you down. You've got a very... <laughs> Why have you? Why, why the fuck? How am I supposed to know that? Are those Walkers baked? I only know they're Walkers baked from this here. I could sort of decipher that, but even then, I'm not 100 sure. And a barbecue pulled beef and matured cheddar. That does look really, really good. It also looks quite spenny, but I feel as though that looks like it would be worth the extra few quid. I feel as though this is one of those five pound Sainsbury's meal deals. That's really good. I mean, I can't have that because I'd be allergic to peanuts. Why am I rating it based on that? You know what? This is a this is a solid eight. I'm giving that an eight. Right. The lowest resolution chicken tomato and basil pasta picture I've ever seen. Decent pasta choice. Yes, an innocent juice. Very good. And a McCoy's Thai sweet chicken. Never tried those before, but... I, they look quite good. I'll give you a seven for that one. I, I think that's a fair rating. This is what I usually get. Yes, the Cornish pasty is considered a snack. All right, chicken and bacon. I don't. I always find the chicken and bacon sandwiches a bit dry. Even though it has mayonnaise, it, it always just feels a bit dry to me. And a Cornish pasty, okay. And uh, man, you, what is just like a full fat Coke? Who drinks full fat Coke these days out of choice? I, I don't know. I'm not really too big a fan of Cornish pasties. The sandwich is a bit dry and you got a Coca-Cola for a drink. Uh, I don't know. I'm going to give you a... I'll give you a four for that. It's not much better than the ham one. What the fuck is this? Monster Pacific Punch. <laughs> that looks absolutely vile. Beef hula hoops. No. No. And tuna and sweet. Okay, you know what? I can get behind a good old tuna and sweet corn sandwich. It depends where you're eating it, though. If you are eating this in public, like you're at school or college and you're eating this, you're wrong. You, you can't put other people through that. But if you're just eating it at home, yeah, I can I can back it. The rest of this meal deal, however, I I, I cannot justify. This is a two. Hoisin dark Thai sweet chili sensations and a Lipton peach iced tea. I always feel as though when people get like peach iced tea with a meal deal, they're not maximizing the value they can get out of the meal deal, which is kind of like my, my goal all the time. So I'll get like one of the smoothies or juices or whatever. But to be honest, they don't work all that well to hydrate. This is an excellent hydration drink. Good balance between getting the best value out of your meal deal and having something that is like drinkable. I like this meal deal. This is a good meal deal. I'll give you a seven. 7.5 actually. Chicken, tomato and basil, pasta, good choice. Mountain Dew. <laughs> <laughs> I always find Mountain Dew a bit too like syrupy. It's like a very syrupy Seven Up and pineapple. Mm, I, I I do rate a good uh, pineapple snack. You know that's fine. That's a fine meal deal. I'll give you a six for that. Oh, this goes hard. Brie bacon and chili chutney. I know this is going to sound like... In, in, is this actually a Waitrose one or is this a Sainsbury's one? I think this is a Waitrose one. Because when I used to live in Canary Wharf, I used to go to Waitrose and get a meal deal from there. Oh, no, no, no. You're going to call me a Tory for going to Waitrose. It was, just, it was just near my gym, so I went there and got a meal afterwards. This sandwich goes unbelievably hard. It's incredible. Urban fruit strawberry. Gently baked strawberries. What is that? Is it like, <laughs> is it like Tory fruit winders or something? What is this? And a ripe, weird drink. I don't know. It's a weird, weird drink to get with a meal deal. But that's the best sandwich. I haven't seen anyone list this one before. So for that alone, I'm going to give you a seven and a half. Smokes bacon and ketchup. I'm, I didn't even know they did that sandwich. It doesn't sound too bad, but I don't like the idea of ketchup already being in something and, and then being sat on a shelf for ages. Do you know what I mean? I either want it done fresh or I do it myself out the squeezy bottle. Chicken satay skewers. Good. Good choice. Oh, and a fridge. I know I said that milkshakes aren't a good uh, drink for a meal deal because they make you feel heavy afterwards and it's a lunchtime thing. However, 
the fridge fudge brownie flavor milkshake. Oh, now that is a milkshake. I like this. I'm not a, I, the sandwich. I, no, I don't think so. But the rest of it's pretty good. I'll, I'll give you a six for it. Oh, yes, another individual of taste. Brie, bacon, and chili chutney sandwich. Yes! A Tropicana orange and mango. I don't rate that. I don't rate that as a, as a meal deal drink. No. And hula hoop. It, it pains me to say this, but I'm gonna have to give you a four. I can't believe a meal deal with this god tier sandwich in it is getting a four. The other two things, they're just they're just so poor. Tuna crunch, I don't even know, like a sub or something. I always find those, I don't know, I don't like them. I don't like them. They're too bready. So it's called Original and a Dr. Pepper. Ah! Yeah, I mean, it's an all right snack and an all right drink. Yeah, I'll give you a five. Right, we've got basil, pesto, and semi-dried tomato pasta. Quite like the sound of that. And innocent energize. And mango, that's really good. That's a really good meal deal. I'll give you a seven. Smoked ham and cheddar, absolutely boring. An innocent energize smoothie. Yeah, that's pretty good. And tic you can't get Tic Tacs as a, as a snack and a meal deal. Where on earth are you getting your meal deals? You're just lying here. But I don't know, this is pretty poor. Even though you've, you've uh, maximized the value value of your drink it's still a pretty poor meal deal like who <laughs> who eats a whole lot of tic tacs as a snack the snack is supposed to be consumed in one after the meal it's like your little dessert who's doing that with 37 tic tacs yeah i don't know I'll, I'll give you like a four for that i'm canadian i don't have meal deals but here's my go-to lunch cheese omelet usually with spinach but we didn't have it that's not a meal why are you even replying to this do you know what a meal deal is so what do you mean you don't have a meal deal in canada how sad is it over there plant pioneers southern no chicken goods so that's a, that's a vegan yeah. one. Pretty decent. I think I've had that one before. Watermelon. Oh, good choice. And I've, I don't know. I don't, I'm not a coffee man. So but I, I know. I guess I can understand the appeal. This is a really, really solid meal deal. I'm going to give you an eight for this. Two mains because it changes a lot based on how hungry I am, to be honest. Right. So they, they either go for the salmon fried chicken pasta or the salmon fried chicken wrap. Both are solid. Both are solid choices. I rank them about evenly. Maybe the, the pasta gets just, a, just edges it a little bit, but still both very solid choices. Smoke sounds, I don't know. I, I mean, I, I don't fucks with a Tesco sushi. It's okay. I don't know. But I, I think as a snack, it works really well. So you know what? I, I will give you ratings for that. And an oasis. Oh, a summer fruits oasis. The nectar of the gods. Incredible drink. This is, to be honest, probably the best one I've seen in this video so far. I'm giving it a nine. Gold machine super smoothie, a boost bar. Oh my, I'm, <laughs> I remember when I was like 12, I used to go swimming every single weekend and I get a boost bar from the vending machine. Every single time. Sometimes twice I get a boost bar because I thought they were so sick. And it got to the point where I just ate so many of them, I began to despise them. I haven't had a boost bar in about a decade now. I think it would make me sick if I had one. And prawn lights, I mean, it's a healthy option. It's not too bad, but I don't know. It is healthy. It is healthy. I'll give you that. I mean, this is a decent meal deal, I'm going to say. I'll give you a seven. That's a very generous seven. Chicken and bacon, Caesar triple. Or no, I, I didn't even know Asda did meal deals. 25. Why, why are these images so low res? Could you not find a better resolution picture of this? What are they? 24 breaded chicken what? What is that? I'm guessing it's like popcorn chicken, but 24 of them is a snack. That's quite a, that's quite a lot. And a Pepsi Max lime. Um, you know what? That actually sounds quite tasty. I don't think chicken and bacon Caesar is the best you could have done. It's still decent. I'll give you a, I'll give you a seven. Oh yeah. What is it with people when having great taste today? Three bacon and chili chutney sandwich. Ooh, I didn't even know these were in the meal deal. Two ham hock and mature cheddar sausage rolls. Unbelievable choice. Higgity food is just great. And a Harry Bronson's. Oh, you know what? This is next level. This is is next level some posh iced tea posh sausage rolls and a posh sandwich they're just oh that's good that's a good good meal deal i feel as though you're maximizing your value for money here oh this one apparently this one in particular is a sainsbury's one this isn't a waitrose one i always got the waitrose one i thought it was sick but anyway I, you know what i'm giving that a 10 that is unbelievable well done andrea i hope i pronounced that right well done indeed sir or ma'am i haven't looked at your profile what the fuck is that bacon and free range egg Ugh. people that get egg sandwiches just they're nonces, aren't they? They should be locked up for life. Terrible choice. How did that win? The Sandwich and Food To Go Industry Awards. Okay, I think I don't think this is for this particular sandwich because I'll be like, are they? Do, do they not have taste buds? I think it's just for the on-the-go range or whatever. High sweet cheese chicken. Uh, not tried them, but decent. And a cost. Of co that's not in the fucking. Is that in the meal deal? Is that in the meal deal? I don't know. If it is, right. I'm, oh, still, this is pretty poor. I'm gonna give you a. The sandwich mocks you down so much. I'm gonna give you a two. Oyster duck sandwich. Discos. I did not even know they did discos anymore. And a, a Pepsi Max. It's pretty boring. It's like an NPC meal deal. I'll give you a four. Just have no mayo. The saddest looking sandwich ever. Fridge Raiders. Okay, I can get behind it. They do stink a little bit. So if you, I mean, if you're going to class, college or whatever, not a good choice. And a Yazoo. Oh, I do love a Yazoo. I don't know. It's The sandwich really brings
brings you down. I feel as though that is the real meat and potatoes of the meal deal. A lot rests on the rating of the sandwich. But yeah, no, I, I'll give you a five because the other two choices aren't that bad. Alright, what is this? They, for some reason, photoshopped their meal deal onto, onto, a, onto a bench. Sausage, bacon, and egg, triple, vile, vile, human, and Pepsi Max, cherry, and prawn cocktail. You must stink, my friend. Your mates might not tell you this, but you stink. That's... Terrible. One out of ten. All right, we've got a Sprite. I do rate a Sprite. I'm, I'm drinking a, a Seven Up right now. I like lemonade type drinks. A, a very, <laughs> very pixelated chicken sandwich salad. Chicken sandwich salad. Chicken salad sandwich. Bit, I don't know that one. I always find that one a bit bland. And some barbecue beef hula hoops. I mean, it's quite poor in it. It's quite poor showing. I'll give you a three. Got this on my way to Eurovision. The fuck is that? What? Can you show me a bit more zoomed in? Who, who do you think I am? How am I supposed to see that? You can't even zoom in on Twitter images. Okay, there we go. We get there. We go. We got visual on the on the words. Roast flavored chicken straws. Is that your mate? That's a show. That's like a side. I don't know. This is your meal deal. I mean, I kind of rate the drink and that, but like the the main really. I don't know. It looks nice enough, but it just wouldn't be very filling. I'll, I'll give you a five for that. All right. So we got uh, a PNG image of some wine gums. I didn't even know they were in the meal deal. That's a good choice to be fair. An orange Lucas A. Right. And, bruv, I can't, what do you mean? I can't read that. What would it, a feta and, what, I don't know what that says. I can't rate this. I don't know what it says. I think it, oh, it's sun-dried tomatoes, because I can see them. And pasta. Sun-dried tomato pasta. I think that's what it says. Barbecue pasta. Is that barbecue? I'm not sure. That's a good choice, man. Uh, not too sure about the drink. Snack's good. I'll give you a seven. Ham and egg sandwich. Deep fill. Uh... A, uh, what is this? A, a grab it. Nice and spicy chicken stick. Hmm, that does seem like a good snack. I do love a savory snack and a Vimto. A bit sweet for my liking for a, for a drink at lunchtime. I, I don't know. This is quite poor. I, I I don't mind the drink. I think the snack looks quite nice. That, however, is absolutely... Do you get a spa meal deal? I didn't even know spa did meal deals. I get the fear getting a sandwich from spa. It's like getting like corner shop sandwiches. That's quite poor showing. I'm giving you a... a Two for that. The most vile of all sandwiches, egg and cress. What kind of... And he's, they, have, they have the gall to say this is just elite. No, it is not. It is just shit. Egg and cress. Who... Out, like, you have a selection of maybe 10 or 15 sandwiches. Why would you pick this one? The Rio's Chili Heat Wave, not too bad. Uh, I mean, I typically don't really go for crisps in a meal deal, but it's fine. And a Powerade, to be fair. Blue Powerade is pretty elite. But this sandwich, no matter how good the snack or the drink is the main is so poor it pulls it down to a two morrison's this is the, that i know i said the other hand sandwich was the saddest looking this is the saddest looking sandwich. look how dry that looks that's so sad the ham is the same color as the bread i don't even put any like fun imagery there's just ham on white bread walk of salt and vinegar decent flavor choice oh, man. and a white monster no. What is wrong with you? That's a, uh, that's a solid one out of 10 meal deal from me. Chicken and sweet corn, to be fair, underrated sandwich. It's okay. Sometimes it makes you feel a little, I don't know, it makes you feel a bit ill sometimes because they put a lot of mayonnaise in it. But it's an all right sandwich. Pink Lucasade. I did not even know they did those anymore. And some squares. I don't know. I, find, I, find, I don't like crisps that are too hard. I like thin crisps. Those crisps are a bit too hard. They're too thick. But yeah, no, this is fine. I'll give you like a four for that. No, I'll give you a five. I'll give you a five. What am I thinking? Four. That's mean. All day breakfast. The fact is, it just has egg in. So that brings it down quite a lot. An innocent smoothie. Good. And some skips. Hmm. Skips I can give or take, you know. This just screams four out of ten to me, you know. What is this? Yule hog? That looks good. What is that? Like pork or something in there? It doesn't say the ingredients, but that looks good. Yule hog. Love that. Tropical defense. That looks quite nice. Sweet chili hummus and breadsticks. Ooh. Oh, you know what? This looks pretty tasty. I'll give you a nine for that. Just because I'm not 100% sure what is in the yule hog, but it looks real good. Oh, chicken, bacon, and stuffing. That, that's a top tier one. Pepsi Max and quite Ooh, why'd you bring them down why'd you bring it down uh, i'll give you a six for that it could have been a 10 out of 10 with that main pigs under blanket sandwich that sounds quite nice oh a millionaire shortbread yes 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 and a dr pepper it's, it's fine this is a fine meal deal i'll give you a seven and a half walker's max paprika a vimto and a katsu chicken hmm there's something about that that just don't look right. That katsu chicken wrap. There's something about it. I don't know. Maybe that's just me being weird. Uh, this is this is perfectly fine. 
like, again, this is like an average meal deal. I'll give you a six for that. Tesco chicken bacon and stuffing wrap. Ooh, very good. Philadelphia light, low fat, soft cream cheese snacks. I've never, I didn't even know those were a thing. Is it just like fancy Dairy Lee Dunkers? Either way, sounds quite nice. A Starbucks coffee caramel macchiato. Hmm. Okay. This has potential, I think. I think this has real potential. I'm going to give it an eight. Chicken and bacon Caesar. Not too great. Uh, Monster Munch. I'm surprised we haven't had a Monster Munch already in this video. Monster Munch is vile. And an every you get water for your meal deal. How boring are you? You can get that from the tap. Man, I can't give you more than a two for that. Sausage, bacon, and egg, triple. Pepperami snack? What? what? So you get cheese and pepperami. Is that is that the snack? You just get the sausage and a bit of cheese, right? And um, what the fuck is this? What on earth is this? Monster Energy the Doctor? Nah, that's, this is a weird meal deal, man. This is probably the weirdest one I've seen. I'm going to give you like a, a three, maybe a two. I'll give you a three for that. Smoked salmon and cream cheese. Excellent. Walker's Max Paprika. Good choice. And Lipton Lemon Iced Tea. Yeah, that's good. That's a good meal deal. I'll give you an eight. Barbecue chicken, bacon and cheese. That looks pretty banging. That does look pretty banging. What's it? <sighs> I d it depends on where you're eating these. If you're eating these at home, then fine. But in public, you get your fingers all cheesy. And a monster. Oh, man, you've ruined it. You've ruined it. Man, I, I'll give you a five for that. And you, you're going to take that five and be happy. So I'm being very generous there. Meatball Mariana. It looks very, very dry. Uh, Pink Lucasated Zero Sugar. Fine. And a grenade bar. That is a really good snack, actually. Because those are normally like two or three quid each. If you get those in a snack... That's that's excellent value hunting. But the other two, a man like that, that's fine. That is fine. That is dry. The snack does a lot of the heavy lifting though. I will give you a five for it. Chicken and bacon Caesar triple and Oasis zero and Thai sweet chicken. Yeah, this is just a like a NPC meal deal. I'll give you a four. I'll give you a four out of ten for that. Never done me wrong. And it's just it's just three pictures of an egg and crest triple. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Ooh, smoked salmon and cream cheese. Excellent sandwich. Melon Melody. Oh, excellent snack. And a, oh, okay, you know what? You know what? This is another 10, I think. This is another 10 out of 10 meal deal. Because you've got the smoked salmon. Smoked salmon and cream cheese is an ultimate filling in a sandwich. And then you've got the melon medley. Oh, so healthy and delicious and juicy. And then you've got the, the super. Actually, to be fair, I'm reconsidering because that's already, that's a smoothie. So it's like crushed fruit. Do you really need two fruits? You know what? I'm going to, I'm going to ignore myself here. 10 out of 10. I'm going to leave it there for this video. Remember, 48 hours on these from the time of this video going up. Oh, look at this shirt. If this shirt was a meal deal, I would give it a 10 out of 10. It's incredible. So yeah, Mimi the Store Shop, 48 hours only. Get it or else. Also, like and subscribe.